again, my Lenard's collection of aliens. Um, today I bring you the drone alien. Different from the warrior alien. I do not have the uh, warrior alien from the same line, but I do have the previously shown um, small warrior alien. Not many differences, except the warrior has more ridges on the top of his head. Different shaped spikes, different tail, and, well, less articulation than compared to this alien. Um, the box, before we get into this, is a Walmart exclusive. Um, here's the box. It is the drone alien. Uh, the alien's life cycle, I don't think you can see it, but, uh, I'm not doing a good job at this. They start out in an egg, which becomes a face hugger. They impregnate, uh, a specimen and outbursts a chest burster. They become runner aliens, or they can become soldiers, drones, warriors, etc., or since beginning of birth, a different face hugger comes out, different chest burster, which will grow into a queen alien. That is, if they can survive, as if there is multiple queen aliens, they will kill each other until one is left alive. But that, we won't get into the queens yet. Let's get into the figures that I am talking about today. Or, I meant figure, because I am only talking about one figure. Two, if you're counting the accessories. Now, you see the layer he's standing on, the background, that is not, that does not come with the figure. Um, the accessories are right next to him, but let's get into the alien himself. Uh, next to the warrior alien that I do have, this guy has jaw articulation, which is something the three inches did not possess. And he has, um, let me just get it out. The tail is able to move without disturbing the spikes back here which is really good but yeah he has articulation everywhere you want it to have perfect for a stop motion and he can actually move his hands unlike the three inches um this is a white xenomorph drone the top is filled with many different colors and layers with high details of uh, sculpt. Um, they also have predators. Those are really good looking. I They look like NECA's at first, but these are Lenards, and these are amazing. Um, to give you a size comparison about it, it is bigger than my Playmates Godzilla. And it's art, uh, articulation we went over already. But here is his accessory. It comes with an open egg, which is from... Uh, hold on, let me just pull it out from the cardboard pieces that we got. Except this time it is it is 3D and it is fully grabbable. And it comes with a face hugger, which is not able to stand. Unlike the face hugger that came with the alien dog. But it's something good that it does is it stays in the egg. So there it is. The alien drone, I do recommend it, buy it, definitely worth its price, $9, and I'll see you all next time, peace.